cartilaginous portion has a blue color here. See, that's a cartilage. And the bony portion is a yellow you know, bone that you see here, which is a temporal bone. And those middle layers, they hold the malleus, which is here. That's why we see the malleus in the eardrum. It's part of the eardrum. It's held by the second and third layer. You can see the entire eardrum, the calcium deposit all the way around. You don't see the, the, the prolixer triangle, well defined. It's normally between six to seven, and just a burly shine. And the shrapnel area, we, we notice that it's located between 12 to 11, and it's retracted, has the tip closed. I'm going to just very gentle open, and before it close, I have to see what I'm, what I'm grabbing. See, I just grab the paper. I'm very gentle. Never close the tips if you don't see the tips. Where is formed? In, at the umbo. And how it grows like this. And that normal migration was able to heal all of this big perforation. Behind the index and the thumb in the middle. Then we're going to control the penetration using the middle finger. And then move, if you see, the Q-tip is in front of the camera. I'm watching any movement of the tip of the Q-tip before I grab the wax. And I'm positioning myself, look the edge, there's a little flap here, we're going behind, move a little bit back, apply some pressure, it's loose, we're going to just pull, and it's actually, we're til tilting the whole thing out. Keratin layers grows outwards from the center of the umbo, which is this portion here, and it's constantly regenerating, and cells are coming out like water coming from the ground. The fatty tissue is a yellow color. Fat in medicine is yellow. In real life, it's yellow also. Okay, a muscle, the red fiber here. And just start pulling out and see how much you can grab at once. Just try to grab the whole thing by the center. Look at how, how we open the forcep. We start moving out. Cool and shake.